Hey there, VR fishing family. This is Doc Cincy here, and welcome to my Epic Fish videos. And after this short intro, you will be taken to the video that you are looking for. And just wanted to, um, everybody likes to see people's lodges. So here's my lodge. I've got my, my shark trophies from the shark event. I've got, you know, all my, my trophy wall filled out, my various leaderboard medals. And um, I guess a more common one, people want to see people's saltwater aquariums. And I don't put any of my saltwater fish in my saltwater aquarium. Um, so in my saltwater aquarium, you will just find all my reward animals. And my um, spider crab is down there. I've seen some people, their spider crab kind of gets out and about. Um, my spider crab does not. I've never seen him anywhere but right in front of me. So let's get on to the fishing video that you are looking for. And um, please make sure you subscribe and check out my other videos. If you are having trouble landing sharks, I've got a great video on how to land sharks. If you are trying to get more sharks on your fishing line, I've got a video for that called my fish buffet. And that is just a way to increase the frequency that you get your sharks on. So on, let's get on to your video. Thanks and as always, happy hunting. All right, so we are on US West 17 and we are catching the swordfish. You are gonna want to use the metal jig and the easiest way to do this is, um, can't that swirls. It's hard to keep the metal jig at middle or bottom. Um, you probably have you know, more frequency if you're fishing all levels, but you know, I try to do my guides to give you the best odds of hooking the exact fish you're looking for. But you also notice the swell shark also likes the metal jig on top, so you might get the swell shark. So it's a two for one. Um, the other problem is there is a, another distractor fish. Um, let's see if I can get over here. The yellowtail amberjack likes the metal jig on top too. So there's no way to know exactly which one you might be hooking. Um, there is one more fish, but it's a smaller fish. I think it might be. It's, it's one of these um, type but it won't run when you hook it. So if you get an instant bite on top with the metal jig and it runs right when you hook it, it's going to be the swordfish, the swell shark, or the amberjack. Um, you can just reel whatever you catch in um, and you can wait till it jumps. And if you see that it's the amberjack, you can release it. If it's the swordfish, you're gonna know right away because you're gonna see fins. Um, so I already know that this one's the swordfish. So let's go ahead and grab it. And again, you reel full speed. Um, any of my methods, I'll tell you if you would have to delay or not really full speed, you'll get the bite. That lets you know that the fish And again, the goal of my guys are to give you tactics. So let's say there were a fish that its secondary choice was the betel jig. It will only show a red line if you know, it's a drop or you know you're jigging it kind of slowly with the lure if it's a preferred bait it will always indicate a bite at really full speed so that's a good way to know um, it's just that full speed really the Again, metal jig on top, reeling full speed over the swirls. Happy hunting.